Uh, let's see. So I kind of started off just like uh, energy use in my apartment. Okay. Um, and I guess you'll already notice like there's no lights on because I don't really think there is much of a need currently for lights on, and I'm never gonna have any uh, lights on that I'm not really using. So uh, just right there, just kind of sort of simple habits to develop. Um, and the lights that I do have are mostly fluorescent lights, like compact fluorescent lights. Uh, as you'll notice, I just turned this one on over here for her to show her. Um, so those last like. 10 times longer than incandescent bulbs, and they use like uh, four to five times less energy. So, I mean, all commercial and industrial operations switch over to those because the cost savings is gigantic. Um, not to mention, uh, you know, using less energy is always good, less wasteful. Um, and then, let's see, I have uh, power strips over here. So, if those were on, while well, nothing is on, none of my electronic devices are on, some of them will kind of still use energy for um, just maintaining their settings or if there's any sort of like LED lights or certain just visual displays that run all the time, uh, that's not really necessary and those things kind of consume like marginally, like they consume energy. Uh, it's not a whole lot, but I guess um, I've heard anywhere between like 7 and 10 percent of all energy waste in the country is attributed to phantom energy. Um, and then air conditioning uh, is something that uses up a lot of energy in apartments and I, you know, till, till I get uh, more than mildly uncomfortable, I keep it off. Uh, my kitchen's pretty hilarious, just kind of this kitchen alley, but I guess, I mean, I don't have a dishwasher and whenever I do do dishes, um, I mean, there are two kind of ways I think that you can just kind of conserve energy. A lot of people when they wash dishes just like keep it running the whole time whether they're using it or not. Uh, when I'm washing dishes, I pretty much do each of them individually, and when I rinse them off, I just use a little stream like that, and it's just not really necessary to keep it running the whole time, or to use it all the way on. Um, and I have, I guess, uh, eco-conscious dish soap, that 7th generation is a great line, because uh, a lot of the other kind of cleaning supplies in households are pretty environmentally damaging, and uh, even toxic to, uh, or, you know, fumes that come off, and those aren't pleasant. And uh, yeah, then I just let this stuff dry, I suppose. Um, so this is, I mean, this is all really impressive and everything. Um, so what would someone who gets the sustainability certificate, what would they get out of this or learn out of this that you're not already doing or working towards? Yeah, the sustainability certificate, I mean, it's geared at making a career in whatever field you go into, having that awareness. It's not, um, let's see, so if you go to work for a business, hopefully with a sustainability certificate, you could get an idea of how economically beneficial uh, sustainability could be uh, in terms of actually running a business, perhaps you could get a glimpse of that. It's just a certificate, so you're, you know, you're not diving into really deep into the, econo the, the economics of sustainability, um, but I think it gives you a really good kind of liberal arts perspective as sustainability in the real world that's, you know, beyond just like lifestyle habits. You're not going to take that class and they're not going to tell you to, uh, you know, you're not going to have a class focused on, um, on how to recycle and you're not going to have a class focused on, um, you know, buy this reusable water bottle or buy bulk goods. You kind of understand those things kind of from that class. So. It's a really academic perspective and geared at training kind of people in the green economy, I think, in general. Because these attitudes and sort of awareness things are definitely lacking. And you can take that certificate and I think go into a, into a job with a, kind of the more socially responsible mindset than a lot of people um, otherwise would lack without the certificate.